guys, I'm in a hotel lobby. I've come to Aizu Wakamatsu to do a documentary on uh, female samurai. And uh, so I'm waiting for John. Now I've said John I would be here between five and six. And it's now 20 past five. So let's see how efficient the Germans are. Right guys, I'm, uh, we're at next day. And we're at um, the first location. And we're gonna be filming here. So, uh, there's the director doing his thing. And we're in this complex. It's super, it's really nice. Uh, right, just to update this video blog. Uh, we're sat in the car, it is drip wet through. There's the director. Oh, piercing with rain. <laughs> He's German, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> so we might work well with John. Me and John, this is the third time we've worked together now, and we have good fun. We really do. And uh, but it's been really bad because we've been outside doing outside shots, and basically it's just hammered it down with rain, on it, John. Sorry, just, sorry, come again. It's just hammering it with rain. Oh yeah, it's yeah, and uh, there are storm warnings out as well. So, really? Yeah, storm warnings and snow for tomorrow. <laughs> So I'm the sound chap here, we've done the sound, we've done the documentary all day. That's it. Uh, hi, <laughs> we're watching. <laughs> <laughs> so we're on YouTube, by the way. Right. And um, yeah, we've just, you've just seen the food, we got back, we're on our way back, we're in, uh, where are we at the moment? Uh, Koryama. Koryama. Yeah. And we're just about to get the Shinkansen back to Tokyo. And all filming is finished, sorted. Right guys, it's um, now nearly midnight, probably about 20 past 11 at night. Uh, I went yesterday to the shoot and the shoot was in um, uh, Aizu Wakamatsu and that's in basically Fukushima where the disaster happened but a bit further down. Um, I obviously prepped my script and everything on the first night with John so I've not kept you up to date so much because it's been so busy. Then the second, so then the next day we slept in the hotel. Then the next day we um, started the shoot and we drove out really early, you know, well not mega early, but you know, you're out by about 7.45. And then uh, after breakfast and then off you go. So um, we did that. Then uh, we spent all day in a beautiful, look it up in there. There's actually um, a samurai school, uh, basically a school of warfare. So, you know, which we, I've talked about sort of stuff before we talked. Taught, taught, sorry, I'm really tired, guys. Taught astrology, it taught um, medicine, blah blah. It taught you know kenjutsu, archery, all the, all the, basically everything we've talked about in the past. So um, all that's in there. Um, and then we went to sort of a samurai house where all the people in the story that we're telling, some of them committed suicide. So the, if you followed my stuff, it's actually um, you the original. Um, documentary I did with them was Ninja Shadow Warriors then the second one was Samurai Headhunters now this third one's about um, Samurai women basically and uh, the females role on the battlefield um, and of course you know the trailer will come out but it's not those who ask me went it out went it out I have no idea I'm not a broadcaster so basically it's the March is the deadline so you're looking at summer 2015 it'll be out but I just want to give you a quick glance at how it works behind the scenes now this time I've not been um, a researcher just because I was just too busy when they said we're doing the third one I said I don't have time to research guys I've only you know we're here in Japan finishing these scripts so um, what's happened is we've said that uh, I'm going to be sort of like presenting, if you will. So the actual researchers behind it have done the research, and I put what I could in from you know things we've found in the past. And there's a few things in there, but apart from that, I've just been holding for a day or two days to do my bit. Right, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, just to show you how it works out here and how you know documentary filming works. And I couldn't really film on the set; it was just too fast. Uh, you know. Not that it's fast paced, but it's too busy and there's too much to do. And I'm forever sat there and they're saying, change the light, do this. Move to the left, move to the left, move the light up. And they spend hours doing that, but you've got to sit there and let it get done. So I can't be doing these things. So I hope you enjoy this and uh, see you in the next video. And look forward to summer 2015.